take a fireball up the ass. Hey! Must have ignited a pocket of methane. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Mile Gaming and the Secret World Legends. Uh, I'm guessing this is the actual free roam world where you find missions and interact with other people. I'm not really sure. I'm still in this alley right now. You know, my guy looks a little fuzzy for some reason. It's like the quality got turned down. I don't know. I'll check that out in a minute. Let's see what old Bruce Leroy can get into today. No map available for this location. Didn't I just see a marker on where I was supposed to go? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What does this gray mean? There's my marker. I hear a car starting. Why did it turn all black and white? Where are you telling me I'm supposed to be, man? Every time I get close to that, it disappears. How about this dark alley? Dark alley seems like something I should go down in this game. Oh. Goal completed. Head towards the butterflies. Oh, when it's anything, I guess I missed the butterflies earlier. Oh, I see. So if it goes black and white, I'm going the wrong way. All right, I'm gonna throw a little link down in the description for this part. Uh, if you want to skip like this cutscene and any more cutscenes that come along that are really long, there'll be a little link in the description you can click. Are you, are you familiar with the butterfly effect? Hmm? Yeah, I've seen the movie. That just a tiny change in initial conditions can dramatically change the long-term behavior of a system, like um, like a butterfly's wings affecting the weather system, turning a light breeze into into a tsunami. Hmm? Most people take this to mean there's no way to predict or find patterns in a system so easily affected by tiny, random, seemingly... I like how he said that, right, as if he was just shooting for but, the hip, like he just thought it up right chaos there. theory is not about chaos. It's about order. It's about finding the underlying order in apparently random data. Hmm? In chaos. In other words, um, chaos isn't, uh, uh, chaos uh, isn't. There's always order. Always. That order is what the dragon chases relentlessly. What they're doing is experimentation. They are testing the systems. They breeding butterflies. So that they can discern the patterns. The more random data. Okay, what's up they with the creepy guy in the back the system, there? The more data they get back. They creating a model of the universe. One tsunami at a time. Uh, but this this is a controlled experiment. So the dragon ensures that with every tiny random change. They remain in complete control. They are ruthless planners. And what they're doing, what they're planning, is acts of... In a way, they are terrorists. Except their acts of terror are small, seemingly without consequence. They don't blow up buildings or planes. They don't murder the innocent. They don't have a doctrine. What they are doing is a lot more subtle, a lot more uh, effective. They now have enough data in their models now to predict causality, at least to some degree. They put you somewhere, they have a good idea what's going to happen. That's what it's all about. Why you've been brought here to Seoul. Super I'm AI. Sure you're asking yourself, why me? Hmm? Why now? Why did the Golden Bee choose you? The only thing that matters now is that you've been brought here because they want you here. They need you here. Everything from the moment they visited you until Close this your mouth, man. It makes you look it stupid. It may seem like a series of coincidences, random events. <laughs> Carefully planned. Part of a model. They've designed part of a system. It's an experiment. Don't you see? Everything has a purpose. Everything is true. Sooner or later, they all 
go upstairs. Well, I'm gonna go upstairs then. Hello? Oh look, the butterflies. Because I was supposed to go upstairs. Whoa, dude. You sure about that, man? You see what happened to our last boy toy. And this looks like it's going to be another long cutscene. So again, link down below to skip this. You're shy. Shy, confused, lost. Hmm. No, I just know a uh, banshee when I see anymore. one. The dragon found you, and now you found me. Yeah, I didn't even think about it, but everything happens I'm for a reason. Basically, Every working event. for the dragon. No and my name is long. Bruce Leroy. <laughs> Has consequences. The last dragon. They will ask you to do things. She has some very and broad shoulders. Time, she will not know why, or what the consequences may be. It is the curse of the dragon. We do not know why we do what we do, but we do it, regardless, because they tell us it is right. From chaos. There is order, order, and clarity. Dude, she said more things in her than a clinic. Absolute clarity comes in that brief exhalation of ecstasy. When our minds are empty, we are receptive to the truth. Most of the time, you will not understand their reasons. You will not be able to see the consequences of your actions. There is one event you must understand. One truth. The climax. It's my job to help you see it. And she's a guy. <laughs> Told you. Looks like old Bruce Leroy is learning some moves. You heard me say it. You see what happened to her last boy toy. It's all shut down. Kaiden Cho, everything. From the park to, to Arachi Tower. SDF quarantine. Good news for Tokyo, bad news for us. I thought the dragons thrived on chaos. Someone once told me the Illuminati had all the answers. They're saying a bomb. It's never just a bomb. Something worse. What did you just possess like the, the body of a girl? So we fight. That's what us Templars do. I enjoy a good fight. It's just these trousers are bloody velvet. Sarah! Thank Gaia. Okay. What in the hell is this shit you guys have strewn all over the place? Look at this place. You've wrecked it. Look, there's tendrils on the ceiling. Because I have to talk to you. Ground Zero, recommended level 2. Well, it's a good thing I'm level 2. Though this must be a dream, you find yourself experiencing the aftermath of the Tokyo subway attack through another's eyes. Follow the lead of the other secret world agents and work your way through the station down to the heart of its darkness. Since I don't have any other choice... Select your weapon from the bag. Ephemeral... Elementalism focus? Elementalism specialty. Thermotics, huh? Generate heat to deal more damage, but don't overheat. Elementalism. How to control thermotics. Use fire or lightning abilities to increase your heat level. As your heat level increases, all elemental abilities deal more damage. If you overheat, you will be unable to use other heat abilities for a short while. Use cold-based abilities to regulate your temperature. I think I got all that. Hello. 
Oh, press N to open your skills window. It's like an elemental firebolt. Unlock. The hell was that? Now the game has turned into dead space. Ah, uh, let's say an entire population. If this gets out of the top of we stop it here, whatever it takes. Not zombies, I'm not really sure what they are. Spear grenade! Any ball? Yes. So you get the gate open that easy, huh? What was I doing? Don't let it get on you. Don't even breathe it. Slice him up! Slice him up! Have to use some uh, flame attacks here just to check it out, see what it's like. New plan: fight chaos with chaos. Keep the bastards at a distance, then take them out. That's your plan. Well, it's a plan. Sounds like a plan. You've got points, Sarah. Thanks. Just put her head through the gate. What do you even need to open it for? Incoming! Oh, those are normal people. Spirit blade here. That's it. Slice the dice. You go. Where y'all going? We're gonna need to use some heavy well completed, regroup with the team. Passive skills. Purchase passive skills. Unlock. And unlock. A hurricane rages around you, battering your foes with every other hit of its ability for an additional 8 physical damage. Nice. Alright, let's go, guys. Let's keep it moving, people. We got weird necromorphs to kill. I guess that's what I'm going to call them. I don't really know what they are. This does not look safe. Uh, where the hell did my backup go? You missed me. You weren't so tough at all. Completed. Equip your new gadget from your inventory by right clicking it. All right, let's check it out. What is this? Warren Curio. Cur Curio? Is that a cabinet? Heals your ally for 80. This value does not increase with your healing rating. Select your target and right click to use. All right. I don't know how to use it, but uh, well, whatever. I appear to be taking damage because of this black shit all over my body. This old Bruce Leroy's gotta go through here. What is this? I definitely want whatever this is. It's glowing. Learn. Ooh. The fifth. Our wisdom float. Thank you. The cavalry has arrived. Even where the 
refute corrupt power okay. indoors. Take it into yourself. Breathe it out. Will this broken body mend it? Completed. Help, press F to help the Okiri security officer. Okiri? Oh, hey, where, where the hell were you three when that big monster showed up? What the hell is going on in here? Right? This poor guy's getting his ass kicked. Leave him alone, you fuckers. Bad guy? No? Looks like you're about to shoot me or something. Yeah, missed me. Yeah, missed me. Oh, we got a big guy. Oh, we got a couple of big guys. Nice. That guy. Out of the way, out of the way. Something's coming out of the ground. Really? Oh, what the fuck does it look like? Ah, out of the way, guys. It's a giant work hall. I don't think so, buddy. Why are you trying to go after me? You got in for me for it. Somebody else to pick on you, pig. I'm gonna take a firebolt up the ass. Hey! Must have ignited a pocket of methane. <laughs> Can't do that, I wasn't even near him. That's what I thought. Alright, alright, alright. This game's not too bad. Kind of liking the uh, co op here, although you guys aren't really worth shit. Oh, great. Of course I get separated. Is anybody with me? Alright, you little fuckers. They're not stopping. And they will not stop. Oh, this is all to Taking on back. them. Top marks for effort. Someone has to push through. This confusion may be all the time we have. Of course, and that someone? someone has to be me. Look out! It's all coming down! Don't worry, I'm uh, running. It tells me I have to take on a bunch of enemies by. What the hell? That's right, let's just get on the edge. Dodo, I don't think we're in the subway anymore. Alright, now that was either a metaphor for the world's best head or the world's worst. I'm still kind of uh, you must leave unclear. Now. They are asking for you. I'm sorry you had to see. I'm sorry. <laughs> that dude has got some big hands. <laughs> oh, no, only one big hand. Alright, um, who's asking for me? Where the hell am I supposed to go? Move around to regain your senses. Submission received. Chaos practice. Can I look at my map now? Oh, I can't look at my map now. Cool, can I free roam now? Because I want to go run around the city and see what kind of havoc I can cause. Oh, hell no, I'm getting on the stage. It's time to get this party on. This is my moves right here. Check them out. It's advanced shit. Seriously? What if I don't want to go that way? What are you going to do about that? Alright, since they're literally going to point the direction out for you. Uh, I guess I'll take your advice, guy. Let's go this way. Yeah. Shall we learn something else? See if I can read this one. 
Uh, transmission aid, and there's no receiving it. God, that goes so fast. Bicycle shop? Let's not just go around and learn shit just so I can, uh. Can I get a bicycle? Oh. Hello? You've seen. Oh, Jesus Christ. Can I get that stuff somewhere? Is there somewhere else in here that I can read that stuff at? Mm -hmm. What is this? The Shire? Can I go into it? No, I can't. But it is very pretty. Alright, apparently I need to go this way. Dragon's Coil. Travel. Dojang. Do you want to enter the Dojang? Uh, you know what? I don't really know how long this episode's going on for. We'll grab this uh, right here and get a little bit more XP. Yeah, guys, uh, another mission down. Uh, Bruce Leroy's, uh... He's finding his footing. Of course, he just played as a girl, apparently. He just, you know, it's like that episode of Star Trek when Picard was sent back in time by Q, but... You know, Picard still looked the same to us and Q, but to everyone else, he looked like his young self. I guess that was kind of the same situation, except, uh, to everyone else, this guy looked like a girl. Uh, I'm just gonna stop it here, you all, and, uh, let me know if you like this series and you want me to continue it, because I'm kind of indifferent about it, so, uh, Thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you all in the next episode very soon.